How's it going, Becky? Oh, you know, as you do when you have small hands, painting takes longer. So it's Tuesday night and I decided that I wanted to rain tonight. So I decided I'm gonna go to the movies because when it comes to the summer, I like like to do outside activities unless it's really gross out. So I'm like, oh my God, it's raining. I can finally go to the movies again. And I'm seeing Will You Be My Neighbor. I really wanted to go see it. I've heard amazing things. So that's what I'm doing. <laughs> That was such a good film. It, it did feel a little slow at times, but I mean, that's Mr. Rogers for you, which is pretty cool. Best part was at the very end, well, it was a very small theater. There's only like 30 people there and it was like packed, but um, the best part was at the end, like nobody left. They everybody just like stayed and waited through the entire credits, which is like, when, when does that ever happen when you go to the theater? So I thought that was really special. Everybody was obviously just like taking a moment because it is a, a deep, movie that is a deep film hi danny are we happy to be at the vet huh <laughs> see how much you've grown come on come here wow i thought you were fatter danny <laughs> we are at danny's new vet because we moved and i think we like it so far danny seems very happy although he hasn't met the doctor yet so Maybe he'll be very unhappy soon. I think I just have to get him updated on his medicine and that kind of stuff. Nothing too serious today. So you're off the hook for now, Danny. Hi, guys. It's Friday. I feel like I have to whisper because it's so quiet. You don't have to whisper! Whoa. Because it's so quiet and serene. Oh, it's just going to go through this light. It's very blue in here. I think it's because of the Diva light, which is the new purchase, by the way. Right now, we're working on some sconces. <laughs> so freaking cute. Who loves? I love. We had to relocate the pothos from on top of the fridge to here to get some shots. But we are doing four different wall sconces. I don't, when's this video going up? This vlog will go up before the video. So I don't want to give away too much, but they all look amazing. Oh, it's bright in here. And uh, we're really excited. Oh, it's so good, right? Okay, hold on, can't show, can't show you. But behind the scenes magic. We also got a new mic, so. Let us know if the lighting and audio sounds better in our new videos because we, we bought some things from Amazon. What the heck are you doing? <laughs> Mini manicures. This is still Friday even though we changed outfit. We're filming a new video now. Oh my God. I don't even have to tell you what the video is, but I'm doing myself. Any tiny hand. <laughs> you wish you had that. Oh, I guess you kind of have a pink manicure. I wish I had this color. <laughs> this is gonna come off? I'm not married. <laughs> yeah, I tried it, it scrapes off. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm living. <laughs> I'm living. Your inspiration. Always, always about us. Okay. Who did it better? Listen, who did it better? <laughs> Tiny hands clearly did it better. Look how, look how, look how not straight your tree lines are. Oh, oh my god. I tried. It's because it was taped to the, the hand too. So it's like kind of wobbly. <laughs> I love how it's like the same thing though. <laughs> I know. You should have drawn a happy rock with like a oh, smiley oh face. Yes. Sorry. We don't have time for all of this. Sorry. Watch the oh, okay. to Bob Ross video if you haven't seen it. <laughs> Hi guys, it's Friday evening. I haven't really vlogged anything much at all this week and I apologize last week I was kind of absent too. I just felt like I needed I needed to take some time and I've really been enjoying my unplugging moments and getting home and not filming anything. I've just been like taking some time to kind of reevaluate a lot of things and like think about you know what makes me happy and where I want to be in life and um, windows are down. Definitely not saying that vlogging doesn't make me happy because <laughs> it does, it totally does. I love sharing my life with you guys and just having these memories, it's really cool. But I've also just been really enjoying, you know, not for a little bit, <laughs> if that makes sense. I hope you guys understand the why I've maybe been taking some days off. I just feel like I've needed it. I still need it maybe. I'm just trying to figure out, you know, like what, 
where I want to be and like you know what's been making me happy and not happy so I haven't figured it out yet I'm still not up the other side of that hill yet but um, I appreciate you guys like allowing me to kind of take a little bit of that self journey and work on those things but it's nothing major nothing major at all I'm super happy life is great all that good stuff um, there's a really good book that if you guys haven't read it you should read it it's called um, the life-changing magic of not giving a fuck. it's a what's the word it's kind of like a parody that's the word. It's kind of like a parody of the life-changing magic of tidying up, which is about cleaning your house, whereas this one's about cleaning your mental space. I read it like oh, more than over a year ago, but it's still, it's still doing things up here. So if you haven't read it, read it. <laughs> I will link it below. But tonight we are going up to Austin's family's house. We hang out there a lot. I'm sure you guys have realized. I think some people got confused because they were like, wow, your house looks great. And I'm like, yeah, it's not my house. It's Austin's parents' house. But we go there a lot because it's nice. So that's where I'm going tonight. Taking Danny. Taking Danny. May or may not film. We'll see what's up. But I have some fun stuff planned this weekend. So I'll take you with me for that. So yeah, I hope you guys are having a wonderful weekend. And remember that if you need to take time for yourself, do it. Don't worry about what anyone else thinks. You know, you comes before anything, essentially, because it's your life. So, yeah, hope you guys have a wonderful Friday, and I will catch up with you soon. Hi, guys. It's um, Saturday morning. I forgot what day of the week it was. And I'm going to do my hair again because my roots have gone out of control, but I rigged up this system. This is just one of the bathroom mirrors from Ikea. But I always find that when I'm doing my hair, I... Like I do it myself, so I can never see the bag. I'm just like, well, let's hope for the best that I didn't forget a huge patch. So now I have this, so I can look in the mirror and actually see the back of my hair. I mean, it's so like obvious, but I just haven't done it. Um, so I think this will make things easier this time. And also I'm gonna try something a little different this time as well. When I bleach my roots, I use 10 developer, which is the gentlest developer you can get. And even so, my hair bleaches so quickly. I don't know if it's because I have a lot of hair, so by the time I get to the end, the front is already super, like, blonde <laughs> or my hair just takes bleach really well I don't know what it is but this time I'm gonna mix the bleach and then add in conditioner as well to do more of like a bleach wash because I think that will dilute the bleach a little bit and then make it more even I think because I want to have it all on my hair so it can sit and evenly bleach out instead of the the first part started with being very blonde and the ends not being that bleached <sighs> hopefully that makes sense so I'm gonna try that and I will let you know my thoughts afterwards Hey, okay. I really liked that. I mixed a bunch of conditioner in with the bleach and I feel like it was, it developed maybe a bit slower. It was easier to apply because it was creamier and I feel like it just blended really well. I didn't have any issues at all. I'm like super happy every time I do it, even though I kind of do it the same way every time. It's so like, is it gonna work this time? But yeah, I'm glad that that's done. So tonight I'm actually going with my mom and my sister to go see Wicked, the Broadway show. I'm very excited. I have seen it before, but it's so good that I'm just as excited to see it again. <laughs> so we're gonna go out uh, to dinner before and then go see that. And then after a friend of ours is having a party, so I'm gonna go to that. And yeah, that's about my night, but I have to leave like very soon. Um, I'm gonna try and transit there instead of driving because I don't want to be stuck with a car downtown. So I gotta leave, but I gotta do something about this first and then we'll go. Okay, I'm leaving now. I just wanted to show you real quick my outfit of the night. These pants are from Aritzia. They're like the faux leather ones. This shirt is from Urban Outfitters. This like kimono thing is from Zara. Uh, it's actually what I wore to the uh, streamies, shorties. Oh my god. <laughs> It's actually what I wore to the shorties, but I wore it as like a dress, but now it's like a sweater thing. And then shoes, these are my new favorite thing. Um, they are Jeffrey Campbell, like the rain boots. Focus, please. Just wants to focus on the dust in my mirror. But they're like, they have this chunky platform to them, which is really cool. And they're actually so comfortable. So uh, yeah, that uh, is very dark. Okay, it wants to be dark. Um, that's what we're working with. I'm heading out now and I will see you in a bit. This is beautiful. Okay, somebody's got your picture for you. Can you guys do a selfie? Yeah, we can. And then send it to me. Okay, I'm here with my mommy and my sister. Yeah. 
always taking photos. <laughs> and the show is about to start, and we are so excited. Are you excited? Oh, thank you for this gift, girls. I'm so excited. So excited. Hey guys, it's Saturday and me and some friends are out here at Halen's Point, which is at the island in Toronto. And we're doing a little trash cleanup. And I feel like I could spend the entire day on this one spot because do you see this? Microplastics, just everywhere. They're broken down. And I just don't even know how to pick them up. It makes me really frustrated. Gloves. Sorry, oh yeah, I'm not touching it without gloves, okay. sorry. We've been here for five minutes. Maybe found like half a dozen tampons. So I'm just gonna take this time to let you guys know about the Diva Cup. If you don't know about it, look it up. It's a good alternative to the good old tampon. Yeah. <laughs> right? <laughs> drop back into the water. <laughs> oh my god, trash haul. Cute. I don't know like any of these people, so it's kind of weird to vlog, but I'm just gonna do it anyways. Stop looking at me. Okay. Tell us about Reset. So Reset is a digital detox summer camp for adults. Yeah. It takes place in Halliburton, Ontario at one of the great, greatest summer camps in all of Ontario, Camp White Pine. It's August long weekend. Uh, it's fully immersive. There's art, there's culture, there's workshops, there's sports, there's games. And luckily, Kelsey has won a $300 voucher. Because basically I picked up garbage. Yeah. Bringing okay. up the best garbage. I'll leave a link below if you guys are interested in that. I love summer camp as a kid, so I'm not sure if I'll be able to make it yet, depending on my schedule. Yeah, but I, if I go, I won't be vlogging it because it's digital detox. But uh, if you guys are interested in that and you're in the Ontario area, maybe we'll see you there. But you have to come with a nickname. Yeah, yeah. Coco, so Coco. Max. And we just gave Kelsey Mermaid. So. Mermaid, I like it. Awesome. She's TBD, working on it. TBD. TBD. Okay, Wicked was amazing. I didn't expect anything less, but it was so much fun going with my mom and my sister. So now I'm actually on my way to stop in at that party, and you guys will actually know where this is because this is the party for Sideways Studio. It's their launch party. We made over their space um, in a Styles Selected episode, but now they're having an official party to celebrate the new space. So I'm going in now, and this is cool. I'm tired, but I'm like, I have to go. I help make this place like look awesome. So I'm really excited to see it and see everyone like celebrating it. Oh, it's gonna be so fun. Place still looks clean, boys. I'm not mad. <laughs> looks <Aww>. good. 